what's going on guys today i'm gonna show you how to fix your playstation 3 that has a noisy what's a noisy fan and so um uh, re recently my ps3 is uh, like this for like the past two days and i'm gonna show you guys so hear this so when i turn on you hear this You, you can hear that noise that means the fan I think it's already like worn out or like there's like dirt here because the fan is right here and and what's and dangerously with without the noise um with the noises uh, I think your your PS3 slim is gonna overheat as in like super badly um you have to fix this right away and yeah um, I'm gonna show you how to what's that to yeah maybe there's like debris debris inside the fan so yeah i think i'm gonna fix that and so here are all the tools you need screwdriver flathead screwdriver and and, and a phillips screw yeah there's your thing your ink kit and this one i think that's all you need um what's that i think it's just the i think there's like debris lung inside so yeah uh, i'm gonna You hear that guys so it is actually um yeah so yeah um my thing is yeah hot right now and so so yeah guys um yeah just like uh something in here you can see you can hear that <clears throat> you can hear that guys that's the fun that's uh, making so yeah i'm gonna go, go ahead and just like just gonna go ahead and just turn this off just in case when just like uh something on it uh yeah so let's go ahead and so the first so let's go ahead and do this so get your thing ready and go ahead always when you start doing all this stuff you should always unplug the cord so that there's no like el el electric thing that that's gonna what's a short short into this uh system and yeah um uh, yeah so like we're safe so like yeah so let's go ahead turn it over turn my playstation 3 over and um so it's around so you can so to remove it uh what's that this like screw here you have to what's that take out you can see that on uh, this like cover and just like a screw here screw here screw here going here so screw here screw here that covering you to take out and just like torque screws right down here you can see that on this like here here and here so um if you don't have any torque screw you can actually use like a small flathead screwdriver like this and yeah so let's go ahead and start so yeah my thing is unplug my thing is ready unplug and yeah let's go ahead and do this so so i'll go ahead and just remove the screw What's up? So like seven screws they take out. So there's one. There's a cover you have to um lift. Um use use like a flathead screen job to help to pry that out for you. Or I can just use my hand. So there's the cover. Put it right there.
The other Five. Good. <coughs> so this is like a screw here. So this is like a cover here that you can actually take out. So this is like the what's that screw for the like this the CD to what's that to eject it out. So this is like an opening right here. You can just use your fingers to pop that cover out. You see this is like a blue screw right here. I'm gonna use this, or I'm gonna go to my tool. Use like a Philip head, Philip head screwdriver. Just go ahead and screw it out, and screw it out. Good. So yeah, I think all of the screws are out. So all of the screws are out. So I took out everything except that we have to take out is the. The torque, the torque screws. So yeah, I'm gonna do, go and do that now. So if you don't have like a torque screw, torque uh, thing, you can use a small, small flathead screwdriver. So let's go ahead and do that. That. Go ahead and just unscrew these. So, wait, yeah, I just, I think now I'm just looking bigger, like this one right here. Yeah, so that's more easier for you. This and one and one must go right here. Good, I'm just place it right there where the screws are and um. The other one and the last screw right here. So I go ahead and just always hold the cover. So 
yeah, the last screw is out. Here you go. And so, let's go ahead. My first time seeing a PS3. That, yeah, so, yeah, this is my first time seeing a PS3. And, oh my god. So, I go ahead and go ahead. I'm gonna go ahead and just put the screws aside. There you go. And then, so yeah, this is my first time seeing a PS3 inside. So just like a clip here, clip there, and go ahead. Just like to use your fingers. Need one. Yeah, I checked. There's no screw. There's, there's no screw there. Right? Go ahead and just open the whole PlayStation cover. So everything is removed gently. I use like this. That's a good job to help. Yeah, I, I, yeah. I think this is the hard. I think this is the hardest than I thought because this thing hasn't been removed as in like 15 years that's the hard thing that's the uh, it's not coming out yeah I think this part it's just yeah I already removed everything that's in here I, I swear there's nothing bolts left and I forgot there's a bolt right here and I'm so dumb and yeah let's go ahead and remove that now I forgot there's a screw here yeah let's check let's check there you go so dumb um, where's the cover? yeah I forgot to remove the screw out um, yeah, so go ahead and remove the last screw right here. So yeah, there's actually eight screws I forgot. So um, what you'll do is you hold the cover gently. There you go. And then yeah, the moment of truth. Go ahead and remove this. So yeah, everything is out. I'll go ahead. Yeah, I just un unclipped the side. So let's go ahead and see the first time. There you go. So here's the cover. I think I'm going to clean this out. So the fan is right here. And yeah, you can hear that noise. And my hands are getting dirty because this thing is old. So let's see. Oh my god. So where's that thing? Here's the cord. Let's go ahead and plug in and turn on the PS3. So the noise is coming here from this fan. 
Maybe you should never touch this or else you cut your fingers or something. Or uh, maybe it's gonna be here, here, yeah. Yeah, the noise is actually coming from here. Um, I'm gonna turn turn this off. There we go. So that's the sound that you that you that you don't like to be hearing because dangerously, this thing is gonna be over. This thing is gonna overheat, and yeah, yeah, this thing is gonna overheat and maybe it's gonna explode. So you have to do this as soon as possible. Um, this is actually detail, and oh my god, it's dirty. So let's turn turn this off once when something will happen. There, yeah, I think there's like. So here's the fun. So here's the fun, guys. So. Yeah, it's still expendable and yeah i think i think this thing is like dirty oh yeah i forgot stupid um i go ahead and unplug the cord to prevent any uh, danger um yeah here's the fun so yeah i think this like uh so much dirty in here because i believe this thing is not yet open for at least uh let's say brand new I bought this at second hand. <laughs> yeah, I bought this at second hand. And so, uh, yeah, I think this thing hasn't removed yet. So, I think, yeah, let's go ahead and remove the fan. I think you have to disconnect this pick tile right here. Press this uh, clip and you wiggle it out. There you go. Put this out, outside. So, here's the fan. Yeah. So, there's like a Philip. You should use like a Philip head. This like here. And here, so let's go ahead and yeah, let's go ahead and just like remove the fan, remove the screws. This one, there's two. So um, this is actually pretty easy. You have to lift this up, just like we go. Oh my God! What the hell is this? But why is there like tissue inside? And um, I'm gonna. So here's the fan. So I'll go ahead and zoom out. There we go. So I just put like the fan here. Yeah, I have to clean that on um, so like um, there's like tissues in here what maybe that's for that's probably the noise so I'll check everything I, I I think it's just this so um let's go ahead and set put the thing back where it was right there and this like screws here that you can actually take out to see what's here so um yeah so let's go ahead and just see like here's this screw here so i think there's like a clip right here i think you three so um yeah i think i'm gonna remove these first. I'm gonna put this here. Um, so I'm gonna go ahead and remove this thing. I put the fan right here. So um, yeah, we'll see. Yeah, I'm I think these are actually pretty freaking tight, though. Yeah, I think um, I cannot even remove this because it's like pretty damn tight. And um, so basically while, while we're in here, so we actually take the debris like this. 
why there is like a toilet paper in here so um i think that's it so yeah let's go ahead then so since while we're in here while we're while we took took off the fan so i think it's a, like a pretty good time to clean this because i said in the beginning of the video this thing is actually dirty maybe that's also causing the noise so i'll go ahead and get some uh tissue paper here you go guys i'm back i have some tissue paper right here so um yeah i just disconnect that for some reason yeah so um let's go ahead and see this fan right here i think this is a long time this fan so yeah i think believe this is actually pretty dirty so this thing needs to get cleaned so yeah yeah you can see don't pull the wire just be careful with it so um yeah i think we have to clean this pretty good so so look at so look at this um more dirt coming out Yeah, more dirt. So, dirt some more. Cleaning the fan, the CPU fan, or, or I don't know what's it called, but so it's like uh, it's like kind of dirty, I think. So yeah, I think I'm gonna clean this like every like once a year, or I'll check it always, but not always, not always like sometimes rarely. Yeah, um, look at that more dirt. So I'll go ahead and clean the fan. So there we go. And so let's also clean the clean the thing where the fan sits. This thing right here. Dirt. This thing is so dirty. So this thing is actually pretty hot though. Because I just what's that? Two days ago I tried to I uh, know what's that? To play and then i just uh what's that suddenly i just hear like a noise super loud noise so um yeah so yeah i think i think this all the dirt we got kind of dirty though but still clean but anyways um yeah, let's go ahead and put this thing back. So here's the fan. So you go ahead and just put place. It's right on there, just like that. And then, yeah, until when it sits, when it sits its place and look. Yeah, I think it's probably of this thing right here. Because look, um... You can actually now spin freely. You can see right there. There we go. So yeah, um hopefully so before we test it out before I put it back, um I'll go ahead and get the screw. and the screw right here so um let's go ahead and tighten it tight it zoom in so zoom these uh what's that i'll say i just picked the wrong screw 
What's that screw? So I just Yeah, let's go ahead and just screw this real quick. Because I just put it there already. So, um, what's that screw? I said, what's that screw? Don't tell me it's lost now. Because I'm not good at finding things. I don't know where it is. Lost, but um, yeah, let's double check if it's here. No, not here. No, no, so I don't know where is it now because it's kind of on my fault. But, anyways, um, you can see span this the thing can spin freely, unlike set last time so um before we uh do anything i just go ahead and connect these real quick go ahead and but so when you hear like a click sound there you go and i go ahead and plug this here okay so um so the moment of truth. Yes, we finally did it. Um, so we actually, pretty much, we've actually fixed this fan. I think it's probably, probably of this case. So um, yeah, yeah, I think that's the problem case. So um, here's the cover. So um, I'm gonna go ahead and check. There's no more noise, so I hope you guys. Oh yeah, not yet. I'm gonna still put this back. Um, where's that screw? I said how many times where that screw is. Oh, finally, I got it. It's here, so I'm gonna turn this off. So there you go. Um, it's actually f fully working because of the because of the tissue. Just like two days ago, so um, it's not even off yet. I can't go ahead. There goes off already. Four, one just like screw it in. Make sure these things are tight. I feel like tight. So um you can see the fan is already working hundred percent. So um I just gonna clean this top everything and I forgot to unplug why. So so yeah, there's more dirt. So I've cleaned this thing off. There you go guys, so um, it's working. No more noise, so um... Excuse. So yeah, um, I already fixed this thing, which is good. So, clean this thing. There you go. Um, I think we're done guys, so um, I'm gonna go ahead and just like put everything back now wait so i go ahead and turn this around and put the cover back on so yeah um it's not here which surprisingly it's not in the anything but it's just this this it's this just this because there's like the brain side that's just making noise and i go ahead and what's that 
Yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and put this back in place. So let's go ahead and put the cover. All around, align, and click in. So yeah, I think, yeah, I'm gonna go ahead. Yeah, click everything back into place. Um, so the installation is the opposite to re removal. So let's go ahead and get this torque screw. Go ahead and so you know what the torque screw is. It's oh my god, um, the torque screw is all about this thing right here. Oh my god. So this, th I think I'm breaking it. But um, here it's it's for this part. This on a on and off button and the eject button. Let's go flip it over. So um, let's go ahead and just put it back. So hold the, the display the thing. Use again your flathead screwdriver or your or your or your T50 Torx bit. And I go ahead and set get the other ones on the other Torx bit. And the last one on the heck is that noise <laughs> so um yeah everything the torques bit is in so let's get the under the rest Go ahead and just screw them back in.
think what the I think. go and we have and we have the covers to put back on so go ahead and click go ahead and so there you go everything is all in so last thing so last screw right here so last screw right here is for the disc so yeah last screw right here is for the disc go ahead and tighten it up and put the cover back down and we are done that's all it takes so yeah so we are done that's all it takes so let's go ahead yeah um let's go ahead and just plug it back in and so so we're gonna check to see one last time I hope there's no more noise, so let's go ahead and test. Guys, we finally fixed it. Um, Yeah, so um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. So I hope you guys enjoy. And um, this is Gaming Joseph. I fixed my own PlayStation 3. Um, so you can actually do this at home by using common handles like this one so everything you have is screws screws so yeah and the uh, other flip side screw i hope you guys enjoy and i'm gonna see you guys in the next episode peace out everybody